Welcome back, y'all. Oh, wow, am I super stoked for this one. We're looking at the Porsche 919 Hybrid Evo lap record at the Nürburgring. Uh, now, I am not an expert at Nürburgring, but yes, it is that famous that even I know about it. Uh, no NASCAR, or as far as I know, has never raced there. Uh, I don't know if it could survive a track like Nürburgring. Absolutely legendary track, from what I understand. Uh, I have tried it in video games. Hey, nothing like real life, but uh, it's something. It, it at least gives you how freaking huge the track is. It is humongous. It defies logic, right? It's just so much bigger than most tracks, and uh, it's really unforgiving, really challenging. Uh, at the same time, it's a beautiful track. And uh, from what I do know is not being an expert, I've seen lap times, I guess, on like TV shows or something, like somehow hearing the lap times. And uh, from what I understand, I believe like eight or nine seconds or eight or nine minutes rather lap time is like a pretty fair time, like pretty fast. Uh, and then if you're in like the seven minute range, that's like really fast, like top tier race cars from what I understand are like super high performance, you know, supercars. So that's all I know going in. I have no idea what a Porsche 919 hybrid is. Uh, I'm kind of ashamed. I feel like I should know what it is and I don't. So <laughs> you guys got to educate me down in the comments on this one. Lots of you suggested uh, this video. So we're going to get right into it. Uh, can't wait to learn about this car. And if we don't learn about it here, I'll at least see how fast it is and uh, learn about it later on. So here we go. By the way, this is from uh, DPC Cars. This will be linked in the description down below so you can check it out uninterrupted. Here we go. That's a mean looking car. Great day for Porsche, a great day for the 919. A great day wow. for the entire Porsche team. Great day for Timo. What we work with is, uh, is a championship winning crew. We want Lamar together, so there's a bond between us, which showed as well today that we trust each other. And Now that's who's driving uh, this record lap, correct? Timo Bernard, I hope I'm saying that right. If I'm not, I apologize. Uh, I don't know his racing history. Unfortunately, I don't know who he is. Dang it. Uh, but he must be really good if he's going to drive this car around. We did great so. achievements because of that as well. So I think treating it like a race weekend was very important today. Wow, look at that thing. The reason why we did the, the tribute tour was... Uh... You know that car. Take a look at that thing. That thing means business. That thing is scary looking in a good way. That looks like something out of a video game, something out of a movie. Uh, it is absolutely menacing and just all business. Dang, Porsche can make some amazing vehicles. We didn't wow. want to just put the, the car after this successful racing era of the 919 hybrid simply into the museum. We wanted to do a kind of a tribute to, to say goodbye to this great car and uh, at the same time with the record attempts inspired here at the Nordschleife. Uh, you saw the movement in there, him bouncing around and then having to mess with the wheel. Uh, even in simulator video games, I could tell on in a video game that the track can be bumpy in certain spots. And uh, it's just a crazy track. And it's hard to memorize because it's so damn long, right? Uh, so this guy's got a lot on his plate. That car looks crazy fast, though. And uh, he, I'm sure, is a very skilled driver. I cannot wait to see this in action. I also wanted to showcase what current hybrid technology can produce in terms of lap times and performance. Cool that it's a hybrid. That is insane at time. I cannot believe that. Let's see it in action. They're going to show the lap, I believe. Lap time like this was always the target. I mean, whether or not we could have uh, achieved it at that time was, uh, let's say, um, uh, a bit of a dream. First of all, with a track like this, the amount of excitement after completing that, kind of similar to the Isle of Man, I always say, or, or even like rally races and stuff, just surviving uh, a lap like this, right? Going all out as fast as you can in a scary fast car is like just an achievement in itself, just surviving a lap <laughs> without totally wrecking or uh, even worse, getting hurt. Also, surviving and setting a record and knowing that you just conquered uh, the lap, conquered the track, and, and basically set the best lap time you could that day, that must be an amazing feeling for him, uh, the team, everyone involved. That's got to be just 
awesome energy in the air uh, around that area. That that's that's really cool. We do have an awesome uh, lap here. I think we have the whole in car lap, so let's watch it together. We have some telemetry and stuff. If I'm in the way, that I can't really be out of the way of certain things. I can't help that. Uh, remember, this will be linked in the description so you can watch it on your own time uh, without me in the way. So here we go, guys. Let's watch this together. Oh my God, strap in, buckle up. Here we go. That thing is ridiculously fast. How the hell is it that fast? This is almost like a Formula One car. This might be a stupid question because I don't know. Could this be faster than a Formula One car? And it's not even open wheel. Wow. Uh, I won't try to interrupt too much because I want to keep this fluid. But this, let me just say, this car is amazing. You got to teach me about this. This this is outrageous, guys. Here we go. Woo! Okay, quick interruption. Uh, first of all, the movement, again, I can't stress enough. In the bottom right, you see uh, the in car. You can see his helmet, his hands. He's just moving so much. Uh, wow, good on this guy. Like, dude, another legendary human being here. I don't know how he's keeping this together. This is quite the experience. Uh, that car looks like it has very low visibility. It's just a, a visceral, crazy experience. I, I can't even wrap my head around it. Uh, second of all, that section I remember from a video game that last about 20 or 30 seconds there, you saw even like it looked like he was going to go off the track. He didn't. He did He did great. Uh, but it's just such a hard track in certain spots and, and kind of just weird corners, right? It's hard to line up even your racing line, and, and it's very easy to mess up. He is doing spectacular, and uh, we're not even halfway through this. Here we go. <laughs> He's hitting over 300. He's hitting over 300 kilometers per hour. Uh, even though I'm an American, I use miles per hour. I do know that that's very fast. I think 310 kilometers per hour he hit. Uh, I do believe that's over 180, maybe even close to 190 miles per hour. Super fast uh, at Nurburgring. Uh, it seems like no speed is safe. So going that fast, wow! Uh, I can't believe it. Coming up on, I guess you could call halfway through the lap again. He is nailing these corners. Uh, he's obviously working for it, too. I cannot believe how much he's fighting. You can hear the engine, uh, the throttle kind of blipping sometimes and, like, going over bumps. You hear, like, the voo, like the spike up or spike down. It, it's This is just so visceral. I'm really getting sucked into this lap. I feel like I'm part of it. This is very fun. I hope you're enjoying this. Let's finish this up. Uh, I won't interrupt uh, too much here. This is awesome. This is awesome, guys. You always kill it with the suggestions. Look at this. This is freaking sick.
So that car being so low and rigid, he very uh, smart decision not to go down on that banking, right? I've done that in a video game before and uh, actually lost control. So it depends on the car you're in. Uh, sometimes that banking might help you. Sometimes it might not. Uh, at least that's what I think. I, what do I know? I'm, I know nothing about being a pro at this track, but uh, it seemed like a good decision to me. Here we go. <laughs> Crazy. This car is just hella fast. It's unreal. The, the way it just gets up to top speed is, is ridiculous. This looks faster than a video game. It doesn't even look like a video game. It looks faster than a video game, which is ridiculous. Here we go on the big straight. How fast can this thing go? With all that downforce. Holy crap! <laughs> he is along for the ride down there. Oh my god, how sketchy! Freaking bumpy as hell! That is the quickest freaking lap I've ever seen, ever, by a freaking mile around Nürburgring. The Nordschleife. Oh, my goodness. That was insanity. That was ridiculous. It was amazing, but just bonkers, right? My goodness, what a machine. That is some just ridiculous, over-engineered genius machine on wheels like that is none of that even makes sense what i said i i'm just i'm just saying that that thing is unreal <laughs> um you know i love nascar i love indycar you know i love you know grassroots motorsports but wow is this on a different planet if if nascar is nascar while well, this is an alien spaceship <laughs> Let me just put it that way. Uh, that even looked faster than an F1 car, and I'm not an F1 expert either, but uh, that just looked absolutely ridiculous. I don't know how I haven't heard of this car. Uh, wow. This is incredible. I have to learn more about this. I have to look up more from that car, from that driver. Uh, he, that's not take away anything from him as well. Legendary performance uh, from Timo. Wow. That guy could fly a fighter jet because... <laughs> that car was about as fast as one on the ground, <laughs> right? I mean, that was just ridiculous. Amazing control. I can't believe the bumps and, and the inconsistencies and just the constant uh, hammering that truck does to you and your car. That was incredible. And uh, that track is beautiful, though. The scenery, you see the, the mountains and the hills and the trees and just a spectacular environment. Uh, that is definitely a life goal at, at, to my huge bucket list. Uh, of a place I definitely want to go and drive uh, and drive on, take a lap, right? I, I wouldn't be going that fast, nor would I be pushing my car that hard. I would just like to cruise along that track just because it's it's an amazing uh, place with a lot of history. Wow, that was great. Thank you so much for the suggestion on that. Absolutely at a loss for words here. I, I, I can't say anything more. That was incredible and clearly the record, and I doubt that has been broken uh, if I were to guess, <laughs> nor will it be for a long time or maybe ever. 
uh, please throw a thumbs up, smash that like button because this was a visceral experience. This was really fun. Uh, I don't see how you wouldn't enjoy that. I really hope you did. <laughs> please subscribe, join our amazing community here and uh, be a part of awesome videos like this in the future. Uh, make sure you check out that description for this original video because uh, I, I'm sure you would like to watch that again. Uh, I would like to watch it again. <laughs> and uh, all the ways you can interact with my channel are down there as well. My name is Ian. You're watching IW Rocker. Seriously, I, I got a mild adrenaline rush. Like, my heart's beating fast. <laughs> that was fun. Catch you in the next one.